guys, today's video is going to be a grocery haul and I have to kind of like fly through this video because I don't have too much space left on my camera. Let's get started. The first store that I went to is the Super King Market that I told you guys about on my last video where everything is super, super cheap. And so I just got one bunch of kale and this one bunch of kale was 50 cents. Like literally look at all of this kale and it only costs 50 cents. Like that's amazing. And then I'm going to be doing a healthy foods video so I got um, these bunches, bunches of strawberries, um, and they were $1.25 um, for one pack. So both of these packs cost me $2.50 for both of these, which is amazing. Like $2.50 for two things of strawberries. I got a yam and a pomegranate because, like I said, I'm doing a video, recipe video. You might see it before this video goes up. Then I got a few bananas because the recipe video. <laughs> the next thing that I got were two apples. These two apples were 39 cents. And then I got two avocados. The avocados were 69 cents a piece, so they were like 130 something. And then I got a bunch of zucchini because I love to make zucchini noodles and like little zucchini bites. I'm going to be doing a whole video on that, so stay tuned for that. And this bag of zucchini was only 99 cents, so like, hello, amazing. Got two potatoes because in my last video, if you guys watched, um, I said I was going to be trying um, a high carb, low fat diet for a week for you guys to let you know how it was and how I felt afterwards. I got one Chobani Greek yogurt because I'm going to be giving it a try. It's pretty low in carbs, so you know. And then I also got cheddar and Monterey Jack cheese. Then from Super King, this is not in order at all. I'm so sorry. I got these bag of bell peppers and these are only 99 cents and then I got a butternut squash to make butternut um, you know pasta with this and then the last thing was this bag of baby spinach and this was a dollar and 29 cents and I love their baby spinach from Super King it's so good then moving on to the stuff that I got from Target I got cauliflower crumbles and this is amazing with like cauliflower pizza crust um, and like cauliflower mash so yeah I just bought this and at my target this was $2.99 then I got this brown rice thing um, and it's like you cook it in the microwave and so yeah I'm not too keen on carbs like when I see carbs I'm like Mah. from Ralph's I got chicken breast and then I got chicken breast tenders. I'm going to be doing videos with these two using them for yummy recipes so look out for that. Then I went to Trader Joe's or Trader Ho's as everybody likes to call it on YouTube and I got a bag of butter lettuce and then I also got a bag of romaine salad. I'm going to have all the prices on the screen because I'm trying to go really fast and so my camera doesn't die. Steel cut oatmeal. I prefer steel cut oats to like regular like oatmeal you know. Um, whatever. This is not in order because this is actually from Target and I got shaved Brussels sprouts and these are amazing and so delicious and I don't have to shave them myself so I love this. And then I got almond milk unsweetened from Trader Joe's because I love almond milk. And then the last thing that I got from Trader Ho's is this traditional marinara sauce and the carb count in this is pretty low. So that is all the stuff that I got from all the grocery shopping. Um, the potatoes, most of the carbs I'm going to be using for my recipe video. Basically all the carb things that I showed you guys will be used for next week when I go on my little trial high carb low fat diet to tell you guys how I like it and my experience on it um, because I want you guys to have a different range of options with my YouTube channel, not just low carb, so I'm going to be trying that. But like the Brussels sprouts and all the veggies and stuff I'm going to be eating this week um, with my low carb diet as I usually do. Um, so yeah, look out for the recipe video. Um, I'm going to still be doing low carb after I try the high carb low fat diet unless I like really like it. Um, but I don't see that really happening. I don't know. Um, so I'm still going to be low carb everything whatever but I just want to give you guys different options and meal plans for different things in case you're not doing the low carb thing. So, that was a lot to say. That's it for this video. Yeah, I'll talk to you guys later.